Hello everybody. This video is about Quarto. Quarto is a plugin for our studio that allows you to create documents for papers, bachelor thesis, master or PhD thesis. In this video, I will show you how to prepare Quarto to generate PDF files. We will use the tiny tech package, but more in the video. For this video, we assume that a recent version of R Studio and R is already installed. Quarto works almost out of the box. I can show that to you. We go to File, New File, Quarto Document, and R opens a Quarto Document template where I can say my paper as a title and I can add my author name. I say create and then I can render it and it would generate an HTML file. But you can see already that there is an error message and the error message informs us that the R markdown package is not installed. The easiest way to install it is just click on install here and it would be installed. It is also the safest way. Another way I like to show you is through the tools menu. Install packages, R markdown, see there's the autocomplete, and I install the packages. This can take a moment. So be patient. And now you can see when we render our document here, it generates an HTML file but first we have to save the document. It will be saved as a QMD file. QMD stands for Varto Markdown. And the HTML document shows here in the window, but a better way to view it is to click on this icon here. It says show a new window and will actually open a browser. We can use the same QMD file to generate a PDF file. However, before we can do that, we have to install TinyTech. TinyTech is a small version of LaTeX that uses our QMD file and some intermediate files to generate a PDF file. Installing TinyTech is pretty easy. The only thing you have to do is to execute one line of code in a terminal window. In a terminal window, you can execute code that is related to the operating system. You can open a terminal window by going to Tools, Terminal, New Terminal, and then you type in the terminal window, Quarto, Install, TinyTech. It takes a while. Okay, now we're done. It took about seven minutes on my computer and now we're able to generate a PDF file. The format has just to be changed to PDF. And I render it again. And rendering takes sometimes a little longer on the first few files you rendered because some new packages have to be installed, but after that, it goes decently fast. And here we are. Here is your nicely rendered PDF file from your paper, your report, your PhD thesis, or your master thesis. And you can share the PDF file with anybody, regardless if they have RStudio installed or not. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you in another video. Until then, happy analytics.